What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu walkthrough. Okay, so... The last two episodes were pretty crazy. I would say so myself. On top of that, a very, very huge thing has happened, and that is that I finally got that capture card needed in order to play both Pokemon Sun and Moon and Ultra Sun and Moon for the future walkthroughs and all that stuff. No biggie, you know, kind of did it while I was playing this game. So again, thank you to the individual who has helped us out. Hopefully this will actually come, uh... Yeah, hopefully it will come by the 3rd of October. So yeah, that, that, that's gonna be good. It's gonna be very, very good. Very, very good news right there. So anywho, in this episode right here, we are gonna be challenging Sabrina. Yes, our girlfriend Sabrina to a gym battle match. Because, yes, we have freed everybody. And look at that, we got Dragonite now. We can fly! Look at this stuff! Oh my god! I can fly my Dragonite. <laughs> Let's see what this guy has to say. Where did you come from? Oh, Palatine. Okay. Fly on my Dragonite. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Flying on my Dragonite. What, 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 what now? What now? You guys are all jealous because I can fly on my Dragonite. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Okay, so here we are in front of the gym. And, well, Sabrina, the master of psychic type Pokemon. And... Uh, Yes, you talk to this lady. She will give us a police set. <laughs> and yes, because we ran uh, Team Rocket out of town. So might as well put on that police set right here. Let's go ahead and go back to the clothing trunk. And let's choose the outfit. Let's see. Uh, police cap. Yeah, buddy. Let's go. No glasses. Actually, hold on. Let's see. Police tee. Look at that. And you know what? You know what? That's right, you're part of the popo now. And let's go back to me. Let's go ahead and use a police cap right here. Get our outerwear. Let's go with the police top. Look at that. Oh my god. Police shoes. Why don't they have police boots? There's the pants. Look at that. Oh my god. Look at this swag. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh yeah. Look at that. Okay, so, <laughs> yep, we're riding dirty, baby. <laughs> okay, so let's get serious. It's time for the next gym battle right here. And it's up against our girlfriend, Sabrina. And wow, look at that. A virtual city. Holy crud. Yo, champ in the making. Surprised by all the glitz and glam? Saffron City is the biggest thing, biggest city in Kanto, and its gym gets a, its fair share of challengers, too. You need to have Pokemon that's at least level 45 if you want to stand by any chance. Well, do you have a one? Show me a Pokemon that's at least level 45 if you want to challenge the Saffron City gym. That's funny, because we're way past that. Let's go ahead and show Sparky. No problem, that Pokemon's at least level 45, alright. Well then, fly off to meet your girlfriend, Sabrina. Alrighty. Oh my god. This is beautiful. This is this is beautiful, guys. Uh, look at that. They really did a, a, a very, very good improvement on this whole city, so I'm, I'm, I'm happy. I'm very happy for this one right here. So, let's go ahead and get to where we need to be, of course... There's the there's the transport panels which we have to actually go to, and it's going to be a fun one here too because we're going to be challenging a bunch of psychic type trainers, and as many of you guys already know, psychic type Pokemon are weak against Bug type, Dark type, and Ghost type, and I do have a Pokemon that is very very physically gifted in that in that little art. So let's go ahead and battle this guy. Are you scared of psychics that use unseen power? No. I am not scared, so let's get this. Here we have a Psychic Johan wants the battle coming out with his Slowbro. Normally I would be I'd be a little scared because Sand Slash would be a ground type, but right here, Steel and Ice type. Let's get this. X scissors. Okay, look at that. Super powerful and it takes a good chunk out of this guy, but of course. They're trying to put us to sleep right here, so let's go ahead and finish this guy off with X Scissors again. And look at that guy, he uses Psychic uh, Pokeballs right there. Now after this, yes, my Pokemon will be falling asleep. Kind of sucks, but it comes with it. 
And yeah, we're we're asleep. And he's gonna be sending out Kadabra, so we're gonna have to go with uh, let's go with Dragonite right here. If you guys remember, in our last episode, Drag Dragonair finally evolved into Dragonite. And oh yes, I am taking advantage of the whole thing because I can fly it now. And here is uh, Kadabra. And well, let's go physical because a lot of these psychic type Pokemon are not good with their physical uh, de defense. Kadabra is most notorious for that one right there. And well, Psychic Johan's like, I never foresaw this. Oh yeah? Did you foresee this? Flipping you off, buddy. I'm flipping you off. Okay. So now we're moving on right here, and again, we're just trying to find a Sabrina. You know, our girlfriend, our lovely girlfriend that can read our minds. So yes, line would be bad if we uh, were in an actual relationship with Sabrina, because she would know, and then she would turn us into dollies. That's right. Scary. Very, very scary. So now let's move on right here and talk to this young lady. Sabrina is younger than me, but she has in she's earned my respect. Okay, alrighty, bring it. So here we go, Ace Trainer Amanda wants the battle, and she is coming out with a Jinx. Still a Psychic type Pokemon, and I got myself Sand Slash, Awake, very physically gifted, and about to do this whole X Scissors right here. Let's go. X Scissors for the win. Say goodbye to Jinx. Okay, look at that, and well. Amanda has been defeated. She doesn't like it. It's all right. All right, let's move on right here. Hopefully we pick the right panels and all that stuff. And this one will take us to an empty part of this whole city right here. So, again, I'm kind of spitballing right here. Don't know, don't necessarily know where I'm going. And it turns out that we're fighting, fighting another Ace Trainer. Sabrina's young, but she's also our she's also our highly skilled gym leader. I won't let you reach her easily. Man, this, these people are like super dedicated and all that stuff. So here we go. Ace Trainer Cameron wants the battle and he is coming out with his Kadabra. Okay, perfect. Again, a Pokemon with very, very weak as uh, physical defense. And here we go. X Scissors. Oh, yes. X Scissors does its thing. Man, get yourself a Sand Slash. Oh yeah, a very physical Pokemon right here, and he's coming out with another Kadabra. So, let's continue on right here. And, well, let's see. Let's go, another x Scissors. And man, I'm rocking that police thing, and what the hell is he doing? Oh, damn. Here we go, x Scissors for the win. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, look at that. We're boosting up our HP and XP. And yes, we get more money each time we win. So now, let's just move along right here. See if we can actually find Sabrina. And this one will take us to the Chandler. So more than likely, this Pokemon Trainer will have uh, a Ghost type. So let's go ahead and use Sparky right here. And talk to this guy. You and I are Pokemon Shell Battle. Okay. Alrighty. Bring it. So here we go, challenged by Chandler Imari, a beautiful name. She is looking creepy as heck, and look at that. Haunter looking mean. Evil. But guess what? Let's go, let's get this. Uh, you know what, let's go with the Thunderbolt. You know, we are 20 levels above this guy, so shouldn't be a problem. Look at that, the power, the brutality. Yeah, buddy. And Dragonite grows to level 56. And he's about to come out with a Haunter, so let's just continue on right here. And... Well, let's see. Let's go again. Thunderbolt. For the win. Yeah, buddy. Haunter. Oh, man. What a bad day to be a Haunter, right? And let's see. Coming out with another Haunter. I'm coming out with the same Pokemon right here. Let's get this. Let's go with Thunderbolt again. But, of course, we're going to get sucker punched. Go figure. So here we go. Another Thunderbolt does its trick. Haunter, yes, landed the criteria hit. Makes his, makes Boy Pikachu love us some more. And, yeah, buddy, Imari defeated. Okay, alrighty. 
So again, spitballing. Don't know this. Don't necessarily know where I'm going. Hopefully, I reached my girlfriend, and this will put us back into this location. So I gotta go back. I gotta try all the panels right here, and let's go right here. Man, I do love the teleportation, and this one. Okay, I don't think we battled this guy right here. The Saffron City Pokemon Gym is famous for training psychics. You want to see Sabrina, don't you? I can tell. Huh? Okay. You can tell because I'm here, man. I'm the only one different from all you guys. So here we go. Preston wants the battle. And here he comes out with a Hypno. And, well, let's go with a Sparky right here. And let's get this. Let's go with Floaty Fall. I want to do this one. Floaty Fall. Look at this Pikachu. Floaty Fall. Oh, crud. And, well, let's see. Let's go with a splishy splash again. Yeah, buddy. Look at this. <laughs> oh, yes. I'm, I'm, yeah. Pikachu, you are a beast in this game right here. And, uh, yeah. He's like, Ark. <laughs> doesn't really show much, uh, face right there. Okay, so let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Again, this is the Sand Slash show featuring Sand Slash, the Alolan Slash, Sand Slash. And we're going to be healing up this Pokemon because uh, I believe now we got one more trainer to go to, and that is the trainer or the gym leader. So let's see. Come on, sir. Come on. Ah, oh, crud. Wait, did we already take on this guy? Uh, there used to be two gyms in Saffron City. The Fighting Dojo next door lost its gym status, though. We simply creamed them when it did, we decided to just have one gym. Wow. Well, that is true. Psychics are stronger than uh, fighting types. But it wouldn't, it, it wouldn't hurt having two gyms in one city. I don't know. So let's see. We're trying to find Sabrina. Come on, take me back. Ah, uh, you suck. Okay, so how about this? I think I've already been here. This will actually take us back over here. I've already been up to the top, so how about corner pocket right here? And this one will take us back here. Okay, so... So far, we're just, like, trying everything. And, yeah, it's definitely not working out. So let's go right here. Come on. Okay, uh... Yeah, we're trying. We're definitely trying every single panel now that we defeated every gym, uh, every trainer here. And this one is down the middle. So let's see if we can actually find Sabrina. Come on, take me to Sabrina. God dang it. Okay, so this should be the corner right here. Let's go right here. Come on, baby. Ah, balls. Ah, jeez. Okay, so let's go back right here. Come on, baby. Come on. Let's go find our girlfriend. Let's go find our girlfriend. And, uh, jeez. So, two and one. Let's go back into the corner right here. And, wow. This takes us all the way back to the start. Okay, so that's cool. Alrighty, so let's go. Uh, yeah, this, this whole episode is going to be bogus just because we're just going to try and look for, you know, we're going to try and look for Sabrina right here. So, we've already been here. Already tried all these panels, and I think if you go up top right here, this will actually take us to this spot right here, and I want to say it's corner. Come on. Where is it? Okay, so this will take us here, and I guess every single one of them will actually take us to the top part. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, wrong spot. How about corner? Come on, man. Balls! Yeah, it's taking us back. Alright. Uh, so how's you how's you guys' day been? Pretty good? Great? Awesome? I don't know. Me, I'm trying to figure out how to get to my girlfriend. I, I yeah, this is This is unbelievable. Oh man, come on. Don't tell me that that one place takes us to that oh shoot. Okay. So we're making some progress, I think. I don't know. Come on, man. All right, so it's taking us to the corner. And this should lead us to another corner, right? And, okay, so this one. 
Okay, so this should probably take us to the middle. So it's in the middle section that would actually lead us to Sabrina. I could be wrong. So let's go right here. Right here. Oh, you suck. Okay, this one actually will take us to the Chandler down the middle again. Damn you. Okay. Come on. We can do this. I don't have to cheat. Okay, let's go. No, no, no. Um, fuck. Alright, let's go right here. Come on. Come on. Okay, right here to this guy. So that must be something. Let's go right here. And... Oh, Jesus. Criminy. To this guy right here. If I go right here, it's going to take us back to the Chandler. Ah, oh, you suck. Okay. Okay, so... I'm going to have to go on my phone to just... See where I'm at. Okay, so hold on just a sec, guys. I'm really getting irritated right now. I'm getting ir very irritated. So, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Hold on just a sec. Okay. Saffron Jam... The map, okay, so... And let's go, okay. So I'm looking at the map right here, and where I am at... I'm right here with, uh, on the second one, so this one will lead us to... Okay, we have to go to the P. Oh, balls, okay, so I think I know where I'm at. Okay, so let's see, let's go back here. And we'll lead us right here, and we have to go straight to H, I think. And... No, where the hell... Oh, fuck me. Jesus, criminy. I need, like... They really need to make this a, a better. Okay, they really need to make a better map than this. Okay, so let's go to N. And believe it or not, the spot was there all along. We have to go right here. And... Come on, take us to Sabrina. Finally! I'm here, baby. Alrighty, look at her. She's looking all beautiful and menacing and... God damn, she looks like a snack. Whew. Okay, so let's see. Uh, we gotta pick a Pokemon. Okay, so we got Sand Slash. Let's go! What's up, baby? Sorry I'm late. <laughs> wow. This is a trip. A real huge trip right here. So, you've come. I had a vision of your arrival. Hey... I have had psychic powers since I was a child. I started when I was care when I carelessly threw a spoon aside and it bent itself into an unnatural state or shape. I dislike battling, but if you wish to Oh damn. Then I will show you my power. God damn I love it when she gets all mean like that. It makes me it makes me feel things, guys. So here we go! Six battle against Gym Leader Sabrina, looking sexy as hell. And look at that. Oh my god. Sabrina, the way you move those Pokeballs. Let's get it. So, here she comes out with Mr. Mime. And believe it or not, Mr. Mime is a fairy type Pokemon. So, Egg Scissor won't necessarily work on this guy so much. Because look at that. Oh yeah. And here it comes with its Reflex. So now, it has our physical attacks right here. So, let's go ahead and try another Egg Scissors. Come on. Let's go, Sand Slash. And look at that. What could have been its finishing blow, it goes straight for a psychic attack. Not so effective. And our special defense has gone down. And, well, let's go with the ice punch. Finish him for the win. Look at that. Mr. Mime defeated. And look at that. Sand Slash grows to level 54. I'm happy. And, well... Here she's coming out with a slow bro. So let's go with Sparky. Yeah, buddy, the Popo is coming. Respect his authority. Okay, alrighty. Let's go, Pikachu. <laughs> looking like the Popo himself. So here we go. Slow bro looking like uh, it's about to get beat. Right here for a Thunderbolt Popo style. Oh, yeah. There it goes. <laughs> Say goodbye to Slowbro. Okay, and then she's about to send Jinx. Let's go for a little bit of a risky choice right here. Let's go with Dragonite. 
That's right, baby. I got myself a Dragonite. Oh, yes. Look at this. Now, I know what you're thinking. Ice type versus Dragon type. What is he thinking? I'm going to be thinking this. Flamethrower. For the win. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. And Jinx. Oh, my God. And the Reflect wore off and it just missed. So here we go. Another Flamethrower. Finisher. Oh, look at that. Okay, so Jinx has been defeated. Oh, uh, yes. Look at that. And I, she's coming out with Alakazam. So this Pokemon right here is the one you should be worried for because it is super strong when it comes to the special attack. Might be stronger than Mew or Mewtwo. Maybe more than Mew, not Mewtwo. But here we go. Going back to Sand Slash. Let's go, Alakazam. Bring it. That's right, you're looking all crazy, and here comes the X Scissors attack, and oh crud. Psychic attack for the win. Not really. Here we go. X attack does its thing. Flexing on you. Suck it. Alrighty. Look at that. And Sabrina has been defeated. This loss shocked me, but a loss is a loss. Man, she looks beautiful. I admit I didn't work hard enough to win. Don't worry, baby. I'm very surprised, too. Mmm, she looks yummy. Your victory has earned you a Marsh Badge. Yeah, buddy. Give me some vibes. Yeah. Okay, so we got that, and look at that. The Marsh Badge raises the level of Pokemon that will obey you to level 70 for Pokemon that you received in another from another trainer. And wait! Please take this TM with you. We get ourselves a TM33 Calm Mind... TMT33 Calm Mine. It makes Pokemon concentrate both it, to boost both its special attack and defense in battle. Not going to lie, guys, I'm a little bit distracted right now. You guys know what I mean. Psychic power isn't enough, isn't something that only a few people have. Everyone has psychic power. People just don't realize it. Aw, oh, come on, why are you taking that cut that cut screen? Aw, oh, you guys suck. And look at that, Pikachu is just happy. Oh my God! Sparky waved around, proud with expression. With his proud expression. All right, I'm gonna pet you again, buddy. Rub your belly. Rub your belly. That's right. That's right. I'm rubbing your belly. Look at that. Good boy. And you know what? I'm gonna do this. You earned yourself another snack. So let's go ahead and give you one of these guys. Oh yeah. Come on. Finish him. Good boy. Okay. So. That is that. Let us move on. Oh, wait, hold on. What is she? What else do you have to say? Oh, yeah. She's talking about that. Uh, so, let's get the heck out of here. No more confusion. Oh, yes. I am all the way back here. I'm back, baby. Whew. So, that is six badges in all right there, guys. And after defeating the gym leader, we're flying back in our good old Dragonite. Yeah, buddy. Oh, yeah. I'm loving it. Whew, okay, so, not going to lie, guys, we might take a small detour. We might not. I don't even know. I, I haven't even decided yet. Actually, you know what? We might. So, we finally now can use our, our secondary team that we pretty much used in the first go-around in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu when I was playing this. Why am I not able to do that? Hold on. So as you can see, I got Ultra Psycho, Tank, Godzilla, Thrasher, Hy Hydra, and then Leah, which of course I will uh, level up later on. I can now use these guys for, you know, just a little bit. I can train them and all that stuff. I uh, won't necessarily use them for the Pokemon League, but yes, they are there if I need them. Uh, this team that I have right now is looking to be like the better team just because of the levels. But eventually, I will be able to use them. Now, what I'm probably going to be doing next is I'm probably going to be capturing the legendary birds that are available to us, uh, both Articuno and Zapdos. So, first one that we're probably going to go for is Zapdos, and then after that, Articuno. And then from there, you know, on the way to Articuno, we can go to Cinnabar Island getting our seventh badge. So... There's a lot more to go, to go after, guys. I'm very excited for the damn near completion of this walkthrough. It's 
we're, we're close. We're very, very close. There's not a lot of uh, after game stuff except for like, you know, uh, the super trainers and all that stuff, red and blue and all that crud. But we'll eventually get there when we get there. But again, thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. Another episode of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu will be coming. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.